Welcome back to another episode of Wine Down with Erica. So today, we're going to be making the classic quesadillas, but we're going to be doing it this cutie's way. Oh, and Baby Ace, I think he may be getting just a little big. What do you think? Let's get started. So the ingredients we're going to use for our quesadillas consist of parsley, fajita seasoning, pepper, this seasoning, Greek yogurt ranch, cream cheese, my lettuce, avocado, onion, my bell peppers of the colors yellow, green, and red, and orange, shredded carrots, more cheese, love cheese, and our corn tortillas, and don't forget our meat. We're using this chicken breast tenderloins. This is gonna be so good. These classic quesadillas are gonna be the best. So let's get started. So what I went ahead and did was just go ahead and chop up all my bell peppers and onion. I chopped up the red, the orange, the green, the yellow, and my onions. Behind me, I got my meat getting ready to uh, cook. And then next thing I know, I'm going to go ahead and chop up my avocado so we can put it in the mixture of our quesadillas. Slowly but surely, it's coming together, so I'm getting excited. Okay, so I got my avocado all chopped up, as you can see. And right behind me, I got my sous chef helping me. He's cooking the meat up for me. So now we're going to get ready to get all the filling ready before we add the meat. With our bell peppers and onions, we're going to saute them so they can get nice and saute. That nice seasoning of pepper and a little bit of salt on them. Mmm, it's going to be so good. So, put that to the side. In this bowl right here, we're going to add our Greek yogurt, cream cheese, shredded carrots, and our lettuce. We're going to put this in here. We're going to add a little pepper to that mixture. Mix it up a little bit. Once our bell peppers get done, we're going to add our bell peppers in. We're going to add our avocado. We'll put that in. Mix all that up. Then we're going to add our chicken in. And then we're going to put the cheese on last. Mix everything up. And then it'll be time to start assembling these quesadillas. I'm excited. Look at this. Doesn't that look good? I put the cream cheese in there. I went ahead and put my avocado in there. I got my lettuce and I got the carrots and I just mixed it up, added a little pepper and I added a little bit of Creole seasoning. I love that Creole seasoning. And just mix it up. Now, I'm just going to put this to the side and as I said, we're going to saute our bell peppers and onions and then we're going to put our meat in there once it gets done. And we'll be ready to go to start assembling all these yummy quesadillas. So right here we got our bell peppers and onions. I'm sauteing them up. I added a little pepper and a little Creole seasoning. We added a little vegetable oil to our pan. Oh man, look at all those pretty colors. These quesadillas are going to be so good. And we already have our oven preheated to 400 degrees. And we're going to cook it for about 15, 20 minutes until it's like all melted and the cheese is just oozing out. Oh, it's going to be so good. Okay, so I went ahead and added my meat. I just chopped up my tenderloins and some bite-sized pieces. Look at that, it looks so good. Oh my God, I cannot wait to try one of these quesadillas. Now we're gonna add in our sauteed veggies. Look at those veggies, all nice and sauteed. Now we're just gonna add them right in. Classic quesadillas, my way, are going to be off the chain. So we just want to mix this up. My shoe chef. And then we want to add cheese. And then, I'm going to add a little bit of our Greek yogurt. 
a little bit of our Greek yogurt. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. now we're going to mix it all up. Oh, yeah? Okay, look at that. Oh. This looks really, really good. Give you a better angle. This looks really good. So the first thing I did was put ranch on the bottom of our corn tortillas. Now we're gonna get a little bit of our mixture and put them on each of these. This is gonna be so good. And you just put it right there. You just wanna spread it around like so. You just do this with all four. Mm-mm. Look at that. Look at that. It just looks divine. There's carrots, cream cheese. These classic quesadillas are gonna be off the chain. Okay, now, now what we're going to do is add our cheese, add more cheese sprinkling on top, this is going to melt, oh man, that's going to be so good, sprinkle, 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 man, yeah. Okay. Okay. Now you want to take another tortilla, and then we're just gonna put it right on top and just smash it down. Right on top and smash it down. And then we'll do it with these two and this one. Look at that. Now we time to bake it in the oven, 400 degrees, for about 15 to 20 minutes. We're going to go ahead and finish preparing the rest of them as we can bake them in the oven. So can't wait for y'all to see them when they're done. Oh, that be so good. So the quesadillas are all done. I'll put a little parsley on top. Okay, let's try a piece. Mmm. That is good. Mmm. Mmm. Stay tuned for next time. We'll wind up with our ducks.